Hey guys, what's up? Nikki once again, and this is a video I'm extremely excited about. We're going to be unboxing the new Galaxy Watch made by Samsung. Now, as you all know, I do have my Galaxy Note 9 here that I got about a month and a half ago. I just released my full review, which is on my channel if you want to go check it out if you want to know more about the Note 9. But with the Note 9, I wanted to get another smartwatch because as you can see by my tan line here, I'm kind of missing my smartwatch game because I used to have the Huawei Watch 2, and then I went to the Apple Watch Series 3 for a little while, and now I'm back to Android. So, without further ado, let's get into this guy. We're going to slide it out of the package here, and then we're going to go around the box real quick. So we got our Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, GPS. Package contains the Samsung Galaxy Watch 46mm and the 22mm standard strap. I'm probably going to end up getting a metal strap just because I've always loved the metal look on the Android devices, but we'll see what it looks like out of the box here. Comes with a wall and USB charger, extra strap, which is pretty cool, a charging stand, quick reference guide, and the terms and conditions, as always. Going around the box, not too much on it, just the Galaxy Watch logo, and then we got kind of a corner shot of the watch itself, Samsung logo, and that's about it. So, let's cut the tape here. And there's one on the bottom as well. And I think it just slides out. Just like that. All right, nothing else in there. We got the watch right on top. Very beautiful, I like it. All right, so we're gonna take this out. It's actually, it's bigger than I expected it to be. That's what she said. But it's also, seems like it's gonna be the perfect size. So we'll put that to the side for a second. Let's see what else is in the box here. Nothing else in that compartment there. We got two compartments on the left and right. We'll start on the right side. It's like we got the wall adapter here. I don't know what's in here. It looks like the extra band, but we got the wall adapter. And then, yep, we got the band here, which is that standard 42 millimeter band, the little hook there so you can easily take it off and on. Super convenient. You got a little bit of a quick start guide, nothing I will need to get into. And then on the left side here, it's like the fun stuff. So we got the dock for charging. And there it is, very cool. Magnetic dock, got Samsung on it. USB, actually it's, I thought it was USB-C, but it's micro USB. And then we got the contact pins down there. Put that to the side, and then it looks like we got a cable as well for charging. This is the micro USB cable. Get that out of there. Pretty long, so about two meters long. Cool. And that's pretty much it. That's everything that comes with the watch itself. As you can see, we already had the main band installed. So it's got this kind of ribbed look to it. It feels, it's also textured. It feels pretty nice so far. Let's get these little plastic things off here. All right. And we got a screen protector on here as well, which we will peel off. There we go. Beautiful LCD display there. So we're going to turn this on. I'm going to get it set up and we'll be right back. All right. So now you can see we got it all set up here and is on my right hand. I am right handed, but I've always worn my watches on my right hand. It's just something I've always done. So far, I gotta say that the band that comes with it is actually extremely comfortable. It feels really good on the skin, no issues there. I might actually just keep it, mainly because this is a water, essentially waterproof phone of up to 30 meters in water. So it's saying that you can go swimming with this device as long as you have the water lock mode on. And that is one thing that I know that's just a little bit odd about the watch, is that in order to put it in water lock mode, you have to go into your settings. So if you swipe down, go into settings, and you have to go all the way to advanced settings, and then they give you the option down here called water lock mode. I went right by it. And I find this kind of odd that it's in the, the advanced settings, but it's I guess it's good that it's there. And what water lock mode is, if you're going to go in water, if you're going to go swimming, it's, it locks the entire device from touching any input, so you don't have to worry about it touching input underwater. It also will use the speakers inside the device to spray water out of it once you get out of the water, which is pretty cool. Now I downloaded this watch face on here off of the app store, but as you can see, we can use the bezel here and go to different apps, which I already set up. And I really like the interface so far. I've never owned a Samsung Galaxy watch before or any type of the watches from Samsung. 
So this is my first iteration into it, and so far it's very fluid. It works at least a little bit more fluid, in my opinion, than the Wear OS that I used with the old Android devices. And I just like that you can jump into all of your apps right from the watch, which is really cool. So as you can see, we got all these apps. And then on top of that, you get all these widgets right from here. So I think this is a really cool, simple setup. It works pretty nicely. The only thing that's a downside so far, at least I haven't found a way around it, is I can't use Google Assistant with this watch. You can only use Bixby, which I'm not a fan of. So I hope that Samsung listens. You can add Google Assistant to work with the watch maybe in the future. But for right now, you're stuck with Bixby, which is kind of a big downfall in my opinion. But other than that, super like, I super like the watch so far. It feels very nice in the hand and it looks beautiful. But yeah, that's about it guys. If you would like to see a full review of this unit, please let me know in the comment section below. I'll definitely get to that. Uh, but I want to use the watch for a little while before I do a full review, of course. But if you like this unboxing and overview of the Samsung Galaxy Watch, please leave a like to show your support. As always, subscribe if you haven't already, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace.